so motivated Look at this world, it's such a mystery I take a walk on its surface to mark history One day Ooh, come yas! How's it going, guys? Boy, Kind Candy here. The next day, episode of our Pokemon Omega Bad Mask on Solar Ryan. In the last episode, guys, we took on Flannery in the gym and, um, kind of just ran through her. And I feel kind of bad about it. But, anyways, if I can move my chair out of these divots in the ground, that'd be great. Thank you very much. Okay. In this episode, you guys, um, we'll be, uh, taking on Norman. So, if you guys missed last episode, you can check out you can uh, check it out in the link down in the description below um, to a playlist of all the episodes we've done so far. You can check that out. And then, and if you guys are really excited for this episode, please kill him, yas! That like button, if you guys are really excited for this episode, please kill him, yas! Subscribe button if you haven't already to join the Bulky Brigade. But with that, I think we're good to go take on um, Mr. Norman inside the gym here. So... We have the speed room, and isn't it the accuracy room? There we go. Let's go to the accuracy room first, and um, just slay. I love how they take their shoes off. Look at that. So, like, if you, wait, 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 wait. Did you already do it? Hold on. If I remember correctly, so look at the, look at the feet right now. Look at the feet right now. Okay. It's like white. It's like black with white toes, right? And I go down, and I put my shoes on. I go up, and take my shoes off. On, off, on, off. I'm sorry, it's just really exciting to me. <laughs> I don't know why. Anyways, uh, let's just go. Let's just go. Let's just go. We should be pretty on par. Um, I think we're actually this, uh, slightly over leveled um, for the gym leader. So I think he has like level 33s, and we have a level, what, 39? Yeah. Um, so we're pretty, we're kind of over leveled, but I mean, then again, it's a solo run. Uh, and the only reason I have two Pokemon in my party is because I have, um, I have, a uh, Lanoon there for an HM Slave. Oh my gosh, it does so much damage. Calm it down. I am actually, I am actually faster than this Delcaddy. Which is not bad. If only v could learn a flying type, or a fighting type move, that'd be great. That'd be awesome. You really realize how, how like how much of a struggle it is to get through a game when you do a solo run. You actually realize how much of a struggle it is. This is a recovery room. I'm just gonna go through all the rooms and get all the experience I can because why not? Um, cause like if I beat the gym leader before I beat all the gym trainers, then I'm giving up free experience. So why would I do that? That's just my question. I swear, if you covet me, I'm gonna be so upset. I'm gonna be so upset if you covet me. Mudsport. I'm okay with that. <clears throat> Not trying to electrify you any any day now. Not trying to electrify you, and I'm just gonna take down this entire gym. Get it? Get it? Get it? No? Lame? Okay. I'll stop. Alrighty, so, um, what's next? The one hit K room. Oh, no, 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 no. Please stop. Please stop. Doesn't this guy have a Zangoose, though? I believe this guy has a Zangoose. I'm pretty sure this guy has a Zangoose. Because it's not, it's not like the one hit KO room, it's the crit room. It's more of a crit, like a critical hit room than it is the one hit KO room. So I think he goes for a dire hit and then slash. If I remember correctly. If I remember correctly. Yeah, there's the dire hit. And then he goes for slash, I believe, which is high crit on its own. Guess we'll never know. Guess we'll never know. And Zangoose just has like the most stacked attack on the face of the planet. It's ridiculous. So that's the gym leader's room. Oh, that door is locked. Alrighty then. So let's just go through the other side of the gym. 
Actually, no, let's go in here. It's the defense room. And is this the one that's like right in the middle? Yeah, I think it is. I don't know why I'm singing. I don't know why I'm singing. Oh, you just raised your. Oh, that might not two hit KO. That's definitely not gonna two hit KO. Alrighty then. We're gonna go for another pack. We're gonna go for another pack? I mean, use pack. We're just gonna go for pack. And. I think. That with that, a takedown will do it in? Maybe? Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Got that done. Got that done. And we're level 40. Oh my gosh. We're so <gasps> Girl. You can't do that to me. I know, I know we're adamant and it lowers our special attack. I don't care. I don't care. Oh. I thought you were in Dragon Pulse at like level 46. Hold on, let me look this up real quick, girl. Let me look this up real quick. Let's go back to Altaria. Altaria. And let's just see, let's just see, let's just see. Altaria is three foot seven. Oh my gosh. Um, by leveling up. Oh no, I do get it at 40. 46 is Parish Song, and 52 is when we get the Almighty Moon Boss. Not like I need it though, because I can just um. What should I teach it? How do I get Double Edge? That's my question. Oh, Hyper Voice. Oh, Hyper Voice is a Bree move. Dang it. How do I get Double Edge? I'm either gonna use that or Return. Double Edge isn't a TM, is it? I don't think so. How do I get Double Edge? Girl, like seriously, how do I get Double Edge? Let me look this up. Double Edge. Um, let's just go learn set and let's just see where's altaria Alta altaria's not in there hello uh oh that's by level up okay so altaria doesn't get it by level up and neither does um swablu um keep going keep going that's only gen 2 centric gets double edge hello uh snubble heracross teddy ursa swine up Mill tank, mud kit. Wow, learn something new every day. Core fish, core fish. Absol turtwig. Okay, so that's Gen four, and we need to go all the way down. How does does Altaria not get double edge? I guess not. Wow. Alrighty then. I thought he got double edge. I legitly thought he got double edge. Okay. Maybe I'm just stupid. I don't know. Maybe I'm just stupid. Maybe I'm just stupid. And that door is locked. What I don't understand is why when I go through a door, why can't I go through the other one? Why does this one have to be locked? Like, I know that, like, I haven't beaten that room yet, but, like, in seriousness, in all seriousness, like, come on. Come on, man. I'm just trying to get through the gym. Okay. So this guy's the speed room? I believe? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's the speed room. Why does everyone have a Del Caddy? Like, for real. Like, girl, get yourself slacking. Or, when does Slack Off evolve? I know it evolves into Vigoroth and then Slacking, so doesn't it evolve at, like level 30 or something? I'm pretty sure it does. Take down is so much power. You know what? No, I'm gonna dragon pulse you. And your speed didn't even help. What is Delcaddy's base speed? What is Delcaddy's base speed? 
What is Del Caddy's base speed? Del Caddy. Yo, I'm gonna draft Del Caddy in a league. It's gonna put in nothing but the finest of work. <laughs> it's base 70. Okay, that makes sense now. I was thinking, uh, this thing's gonna speed me. It might actually be. Zero reduction and the defense room. Okay then. So the other guy's gonna have a dis guard spec, and I've already beaten the other room. Um. Yeah, let's lemonade up. Let's just use this lemonade. That'll be enough. That'll be enough for now. Be enough for now. If only I had, like, draining kiss or something like that. <laughs> draining kiss? Why would I have draining kiss? I don't know. You know, draining kiss is actually power early game. It's actually a lot of power. Then again, you meet a lot of bug poison types early game, so. Makes sense. <clears throat> and plus, like, the one Pokemon you get it on is, like, Vivalon, and, like, come on, that thing evolves. It, it, it's fully evolved by level 10. Right. Let's be real here. There's the guard spec, and there's my Dragon Pulse, and I swear, this stab Dragon Pulse is gonna do so much work! Kill him, Yas! I was thinking, like, when I started this last play, I was thinking by this time, we wouldn't have, like... We wouldn't be this overleveled, but we are. I'm like, hello? Excuse you. Strength room, let's go. And, if, yep, the other room's open. So this is the um, locked door. And I believe that's the gym leader's room. So I think after this, we're okay to go um, heal up and then take on Norman. I think, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we're good after this. Yeah, because I think it's I think it's like they start off with Del Caddies and then go to like other normal types, like Manoon and stuff, and then go to um Zangoose. And then you have like two slackings and a Vigoroth, and you're just like, what? Cause normally the gym leader has Pokemon that are similar to their gym trainers. Aside from typing. But not in this one. And not in the seventh gym either. Or oh, really the 6th gym all that much. They really started changing it up. Um, around the 5th gym. Because this is gym leader's room, right? Right? Yeah, screw it, let's just go in. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Oh, because we don't have an option once we step in. Oh. I was unaware of that. <laughs> I was not aware of that. Dude, look at those sideburns. He's like Elvis status right now. Kill him. And then, like, his receding hairline looks like my dad's. <laughs> I'm just making all the good references right now, but it, it's so weird because he has, like, the creepy, like, if I, my, if I let my hair, like, not, like, go up, but, like, come down like this, it's kind of, like, creepy like that. And then, like, the receding hairline part of it, it doesn't make any sense to me. And then the sideburns make him look like... Elvis from the sides, like, girl, get your, get, get it together, get it together. Look at that slacking. Just being there all lacking days will like sup. I just want to take a nap, right in the middle of this battle. And Dragon Pulse, kill him, Yas. Can we do it? Oh my gosh. Oh, Retaliate is after you kill him on. I forgot about that. I keep forgetting I have Roost, too. Like, I can just Roost up. If I really wanted to. Gosh, that does so much damage. And that does so much experience. Oh my goodness. I think this Big Roth is actually really fast. So I think he might actually outspeed me. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, I'm level 41. What am I talking about? He's not gonna outspeed me. Oh my god. Did he just encore me into Dragon Pulse? With one HP left? Oh, you sneaky little. Hmm. Okay, left. Well, then again, my encore should end when I have zero PP left. If that's the way the mechanic works in the game. I'm pretty sure that's how this mechanic works in the game. 
He's only level 30? I thought he was like level 33. Or is that, or did they change it from the older games? You swagger. Girl. <laughs> Girl, I'm an adamant Altaria. And there's the Encore end. Can we just get this peg off, please? Please don't hurt yourself. Please don't hurt yourself. Thank you. That's not gonna kill. And there's the truant. And let me guess, another hyper potion? No. And you hit yourself. That is a lot of damage. There's a retaliate. Ugh. Oh, that is nothing. I'm gonna roost. Actually, no. No, I'm actually going to heal up. Um, because. Um, yeah, because of the fact that I actually, um, have a chance of hitting myself, I'm gonna heal up instead, and then. Like, if I was at half HP, I might have roosted, but then again, I just don't want to roost the confusion. Then again, I should have thought he does have Truant, so. Feelong! So, oh, I, I would have done myself in, actually. I would have done myself in if I hit myself. Can you please, like, snap out of confusion or just break through? Thank you. There we go. There we go. I need to get a better flying type move. I really do. Peck needs to go. Peck needs to go. Alright, but with that, we just beat Norman. We just ran through this entire gym again. I feel, I so, I feel so bad. I feel so bad that we, like, ran through these gyms. It just... Hmm. I mean, I guess we can start making our way up to, um, Fortree. I guess. I guess we can make our way up through uh, up to Fortree, because that actually does... I mean, I don't think I'll need to do any more grinding for the rest of the LP, because I think with naturally leveling, naturally leveling up and just fighting trainers, um, I'll be good to, um... I'll be good to go, and... I should be like level 50 something by the time I get to um, the Elite Four. And if I'm level 50, like two or three, I should be okay leveling up through the Elite Four um, and getting up to like level, I would say 58, 60 would be really, really helpful for um, Steven. But I'm really scared of his. Um, I'm really scared of his Metagross. Really scared of his Mega Metagross. That thing is so scary like you have no idea how scary that thing is I have no idea why I just said yes to like I don't know if we're fast traveling or something but are you just gonna fast travel me over to you fast travel me to Marvel right you're fast traveling me to Marvel right yeah okay not bad <clears throat> All right, cool. Um, am I all healed up or not? Nah? I'm not. Okay. So, I'm actually going to heal up real quick, and then we'll just go along our merry way and get through, um... Try to get to, Mob, uh, to Fortress City? Actually, no, we won't be able to get to Fortress City. We'll be able to get to the Weather Institute, and that's where we'll end off the episode. So we'll end off the episode around the Weather Institute. We have about 10 minutes left um, in the episode, so I think we should be able to... Um, we should be good to get there by then. We shouldn't... Unless we fight everyone in their... Unless we go into bike shops and fight everyone in their mother... Um, we should be okay, and we should, um, be able to get there. And I actually just got surfing, I need to T-Shot to Lanoon. Need to T-Shot to Lanoon. So let's do that real quick. Let's go into our bag. That's the thing, Lanoon is like the perfect HM slave, only if you could learn dive. If only you could learn dive. Which reminds me, I need to take, um... I need to take that Mudkip in the box, um, into Alpha Sapphire. And, um, level it up. Let's get rid of... Well, we have to get rid of Sand Attack, because we can't really do it or anything else, because they're all HMs. Yeah. Let's actually organize this, because this is really bugging me. By number. Thanks. Thanks. I appreciate it. Um, and then after... Th we, could get a we could get Fly as a flying-type move. Let's do it. Let's do it. 
Then again, what would I really need fly for, honestly? Oh wait, no! We have the Latios event. Latios or Latios? I think it's Latios. Why, hello! We met in Granite Cave, didn't we? No, I remember it. It's Bucky, right? It's good to see that you are doing well on your journey. You know, Bulky, in this fast world, there are many kinds of Pokemon. They come in many types. Should you raise different types, only raise a Pokemon of a certain type you like. I wonder what you think as Pokemon trainer. Not that it's anything I should be concerning myself with. But somehow I find myself wanting to know what you think. I th hope to see you again, though. Hmm. No. Latias. He just says that all nonchalantly, like, "Hey, how's it going, buddy? How you doing? Do you want us to soar somewhere with you, Bulky? Come with me, Latias. I believe that it's on us out for help." And if that's the case, let's go. All right. I didn't. I think this is the only time that l you soar on Latios or Latios, and it does not Mega Evolve. I'm pretty sure this is the only time that happens. And there's Southern Island, and we just bombed it over there. Kill them. We've arrived. Thank you, Latios. <clears throat> so I think, um, I think, um, that there's no hidden items here, I don't think. No. But I believe that, um, what? Those memories who... Those whose memory fades, seek to carve them in our hearts. Alright. There's Latios. Latios, it's beautiful. If it were described as beauty in a stone, it would be a water stone. No, it goes beyond that. Isn't its brilliance that like that of a dawn stone? Why are you so obsessed with steels? It is as fantastic of a steel type Pokemon. Uh oh. Hmm. Team Magma, is it? So Latios, no so Latios, n noticed they're coming, and that's why it called on us. Who are you? Huh? Miss Courtney. That pipsqueak over there is the kid that keep I heard keeps getting in our way. That newly unruffled looking fellow there with him. Hmm, I feel I ought to know him from somewhere. Maybe he's Contest Star? Yes. For the time being, get away from me. The Pokemon behind you, it's Mega Stone. No more, no less. That is what? That is what we of Team Magma seek. Okay, screw it. Screw it. Let's just battle you. I just want to battle. Let's go. Let's go. And why does it do those, like... Why does it do those, like, fortuitous, like scans over like every female's body like it does that to Shelly it does that to Courtney and why did they put her in that stance like that just made it all just like more perturbative like girl or promiscuous rather is a better term for it I guess you could say um that's a poison type then again I'm not even a fairy type yet um I'm just gonna go for a dry impulse on this camera and just kill me off Zen headbutt. Kill him. Oh my gosh. Slay! Earth power? <laughs> oh. Slay! Slay! This giant shark impulse will take you out, though. At least it should. I hope. Slay! That was a two turn battle. Yeah, like, okay, seriously, that stance, it's so promiscuous, like, stop it. Like, it's not okay, Game Freak, it's not okay. And you do that to Shelly, too. It's just not okay. 
Like, this is a Pokemon game. Let's be real here, it's Pokemon. Not Gears of War, or... That doesn't even make sense. Not... Playboy's Happy Mansion, <laughs> if that's even a game, I don't know. <laughs> Vayos, join my team. Oh gosh, I have a nickname for this thing. I can't remember what it is though. I think it's Hirosaki, but I just want to make sure. I just want to make sure. Let me open up the handy little word doc here. Let me open up this handy little word doc here. Um... Let's scroll down, let's scroll down, let's scroll down, let's scroll down, no, not there, let's go. I keep typing the wrong thing. There we go. Okay. Um. Yeah, it's Hirosaki. Um. H-I-R-O-S-A-K-I. I was like, wait, A? Is that even a letter? <laughs> I'm so bad. There we go. Yes, I would like to name it Hirosaki. Carrying a piece of Latiosite. Just a piece, not the whole thing. Okay. You will be my fly, fly and dive slave from now on. Can it learn Waterfall? Can Latios learn Waterfall? Let's look this up. Latios... If Lalius can learn Waterfall, it's the perfect HM slave. I just went to base stats and I didn't mean to. Um, it can learn... It can learn Fly, Surf, Waterfall, and Dive. The perfect HM slave has arrived! Yes! Alright, cool. We just got Mega Voice that we're never gonna use. Not bad. I wonder what are, um... What are Latios's um? What are Latios's uh, base stats at the moment? Well, I only need Fly, Waterfall, and Dive, so I can teach a Flash. Or not base. I want not Latios's base stats. What are um Latios's moves? Cause um, if once I get Flash, I'll teach a Flash. Or I, I don't even need Flash though. Yeah, I don't even need Flash, um, so I can just teach it um, Surf, Waterfall, Dive, and Fly when I get those. I mean, I have Surf, so I just need to teach it Waterfall and Dive. Oh, I do have Flash. Let's, let's, do, it. let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Lanoon cannot learn Flash. We learn something new every day. So what's your moveset? Heal Pulse, Dragon Blast, Luster Purge, and Psycho Shift. Don't need it. Don't need it at all. Uh, I'm probably only gonna need him for, um, probably only gonna need, um, him for, uh, what do you call it, Liz and Tate? Or Tate and Liza? Tate and Liza, but that's, uh, it, and that actually put us up really far on time, so, I hate when they just, like, turn and turn, 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 I hate that so much. Anyways, uh, after I beat up this Pelipper, um, that'll be the end of today's episode. I mean, because right now my timer says 29 minutes and it's counting up. It's like 29.10 right now. Um, but. Really? Are we going to do this right now? Payback? Payback hey Pelipper, okay. Thank you for not spamming protect though. Anyways, um with that, that will be the end of today's episode. So excuse me, level 42 too, not bad. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, please kill him. Yas, that like button if you guys really enjoyed today's episode. Please kill him, yas, the subscribe button if you haven't already to join the bulky brigade. And I'll see you guys next time. Our Pokemon Omega Ruby mascot solo. Omega Ruby mascot solo run. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!
kill him, yas. Thanks for sticking around to the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to kill him, yas. That like button below the video before clicking away to either the video on the left, which is the last video in the series, or to the video on the right, which is one of our weekly Munch Choice Mondays. Or you can be really awesome and kill him, yas. And subscribe and attention right below both of the videos to join the bulky brigade. How's it going guys? Bulky Kai and Candy here.